give yourself proper time to really think, okay, is this necessary? Like, is this really important? Should I really do this right now? Or can I wait a bit longer in terms of being comfortable and just relaxing? Like, can I get more things done? Time is finite. It's not infinite. Like time will like continue on with or without you, but your time is literally tied to your last breath. So invest it wisely. CEOs, what's up? It's your boy, CEO. I'll be showing up back with another video and it's that time of the week. So let's get into a message of the week. This is to remind you and in a way regain that focus on those powerful thoughts that you might not always feel and or be present in due to the life you live. This is meant for you to relate with, thus go forth with and applying the message to yourself. Whether you work a nine to five, attend school part time and or full time, raising a family of your own, let alone having to be the man of the house or the woman of the house, an athlete, someone who is living paycheck to paycheck currently, dealing with a loss and etc. This is just a few things that come to my mind as of right now. Can you get the point? It's meant for everyone and their mamas. Also, I say currently in regard to living paycheck to paycheck because I know you can and will get yourself out that system. That being said, the message of the week. The message of the week for this week is give yourself time to think. Know that clarity is essential in anything that you do. Thus, give yourself time to understand what it is that you want to do next. Reason being, as humans, we feel so much and it's easy to let our emotions dictate what we do next can realize that when you give yourself proper time to think, you tend to rid oneself of certain emotions that in the end could have been detrimental. Thus, think before you do. If not you, then. If not you, who will? Reality is what you do next. And with that being said, before I get into these two screenshots that I feel like go best what I had to share with you, yeah, you for this week's message of the week, I'd like to just say this. Um, you know, it's really easy as humans to feel a lot and to let our emotions, whatever we feel, um, be a factor in terms of what we choose to do next. Can, um, I just want you to understand that, like, you know, your time is your time. Like, understand that, like, your time is not, it's not infinite. It's tied to your last breath. So utilize the time that you have and really give yourself proper time, like, to think about what it is that you're doing on a daily basis. Now, these two screenshots that I have for you, when I say them, it'll make a whole lot more sense in terms of why I'm saying what I'm saying. So let me just say it, all right? The first one says this, Netflix, if I can speak, Netflix doesn't cost $17.99. It costs your time. I'm saying that one more time. Netflix doesn't cost $17.99. It costs your time. Last but, last but not least, the second one says this, energy is finite. Invest it wisely. I'm saying it one more time. Energy is finite. Invest it wisely. So the first one, Netflix doesn't cost $17.99. It costs your time. Now, when you start your day or whatever part of the day that you're in, right? If you have emotions where you feel like, okay, you're anxious, you're stressed, and all you feel like you can do or want to do is just choose to be comfortable instead of being comfortable with the uncomfortable, chances are you're going to do something that allows you to kill time, to numb whatever it is that you feel. Like, just relax when you really should be putting in that work. Like, let's be real. Like, for me, for example, like when I was in school, there'd be plenty of times where I'm like, bro, like, I, I know I can get a few more things done, but instead I choose to go on a binge watch. Like, I either go on Netflix or I, I watch other episodes on other sites. But like basically what I'm doing is I'm wasting my time. But I'm choosing what I feel over realizing, like even just giving proper thought into whatever it is that I'm doing, if that makes sense. So like Netflix doesn't really cost $17.99. It really costs your time. So be wise in whatever it is that you do. Like give yourself proper time to really think, okay, is this necessary? Like, is this really important? Should I really do this right now? Or can I wait a bit longer in terms of being comfortable and just relaxing? Like, can I get more things done? Like, give yourself proper time to think. And a lot of the times when you do that, you do rid yourself of those certain emotions where, you know, you feel anxious, but all you want to do is, you know, be comfortable instead of like push through it, like feel the fear and keep pushing forward regardless. Like, give yourself time and and again like time is literally tied to your last breath this is not something that you have to ask for like it's literally tied to your last breath bro. all right and energy is finite invest it wisely i really only have this screenshot just to replace the energy part and say the same thing about time time is finite it's not infinite 
Like time will like continue on with or without you. But your time is literally tied to your last breath. So invest it wisely in terms of whatever it is that you choose to do. Make sure that you're, you know, doing things that are necessary, things that allow you to grow. You also got to realize like growth and comfort do not coexist. It does not work. You feel me? Like as many times as you try or whatever it is that you're trying to do, like, you got re- you to gotta realize like for you to grow, you have to be comfortable with the uncomfortable. And so when you give yourself time to think, <clears throat> proper time like be real with yourself too because like you know like i could tell you as like what to do exactly but at the end of the day it's up to you really to just be real with yourself and i want you to be as real as possible with yourself because again you are the most permanent thing in your life you know so like appreciate yourself and just you know take advantage of this time that you have like not everything has to be about relaxation not everything has to be about doing things that you know, feel okay. Like you, you don't feel anxious. Like a lot of the things when you, when you try new things out, when you're just trying to grow, when you're trying to elevate, things will be uncomfortable, but that's part of it. Like that's normal. Let's normalize that understanding. Like, let's just realize that when you try something new, when you are grinding, there's going to be times where it's going to be uncomfortable. Do not choose what feels good next. You feel me? And if you're going through something, don't just numb the pain by doing something that's just temporary. And don't go off of it based off how you feel. You know what I'm saying? Like, really give yourself proper time to think, well, if I do this, then what really happens? Like, think like that, too. Like, before you choose something that's comfortable, give yourself some time to really actually understand what it is that you're doing when you do that. Another form of you just being real with yourself. Anyways, that's pretty much it that I felt like sharing with y'all for today, for this message of the week, for this week's message of the week, of the week. And uh, yeah, anyways, it's your boy CEO, obviously, and I'm going to catch y'all tomorrow. I love y'all. Keep your keep your heads up. Well, there's going to be times where like I can speak really, you know what I'm saying? And there'll be times where I even be like, you feel me? Just growth, growth, growth. Keep going. All right. I'm going to keep going. So you better keep going. All right. All right. It's your boy CEO option. I'm going to catch you all tomorrow. I love y'all. Peace.